grateful it came back for a second year. We're trying to get it better and better each year. When referring to we, that means the drivers. We have a great lineup here. For the Dan Weldon Memorial Karting Challenge. We've grown so much this year. I'm so pleased with just the participation and all the sponsors that came on board and the drivers. Including a new one at the Newcastle Motorsports Park. I'm pretty sure that was his first Euro card that he signed. Not bad for a five-year-old. So into it, man. I mean, that, that kid is already a race car driver. It's crazy. Well, not if you consider the bloodline for young Sebastian. Oh. He just wants to be like his dad. Since he is Dan Weldon's oldest son. He really understands that connection with, you know, him racing and, and Dan being a racer. So I think it just really brings to his mind, um, you know, just the connection with Dan. And it's just great to have him be a part of the event this year. Like his father, who died in a race in 2011, Sebastian was an autograph line favorite among the fans. Very good. He does little things that like Dan used to do and you're like, whoa, that is very scary. But uh, it's, it is great to have him here. The young and the old. From you from last year. Clamoring for that SB7 signature. That's so good. Next to veteran IndyCar drivers. I sit there beside him and you know everybody was so excited to get his autograph. It was really cool. But Sebastian didn't come to his father's memorial karting event here in Newcastle with just a piece of paper and a Sharpie. He was in a race suit with a helmet, ready to jump in one of these. He started racing, I guess, in October of last year and had his first real competitive race in, in April. Which allowed him to set the pace on this September afternoon. Can I push you? It makes me so proud as an auntie, bless him. I can't believe he's going to be leading the field for the race. Sebastian led it well, smoothly getting around the one-mile multi-turn course. He didn't want to come in, man. I think he was mad that he's not allowed to race. They, the kid's just so into it. it. It's awesome to see someone that young, you know, still have a passion for it like that. He absolutely loves karting. He's taking it, like, he's taking it on so well. He, like, he just wants to be like his dad. Just as his father may have suspected. Before Dan passed, it was something that he saw in Sebastian from an early age. I think it was just kind of this natural, organic thing that he just got in and, and uh, you know, felt comfortable straight away. So that other drivers might say, like father, like son. He just kind of gets it as much as a five-year-old can, I guess. Larry Hawley, Fox 59 Sports.